How's the audio? How am I sounding? Are we ready to go? Ready to get some more of this crazy music going on? See a blonde head boy. Sweet. He be playing in the fields. And let's kick this and game off and let's go. Hey Cran, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, bud. Hope things are going alright for you. This is a good game to chill to, I'm just saying. This game has some fantastic music in it. So good that I actually, uh... Nice. So good that I actually, uh, ordered the vinyl for it. <laughs> Can't wait for that to come out. Is a real freak out. It's also a very trippy game, so if you're on certain substances... Experiences may vary. That's all I'm going to say about that particular matter. <laughs> Where did everybody go? That's a good question. This place is full of weird characters. Past! Titan's pain! Oh, that's where everyone went. Let's see how his concert's going. And there he is. The Lightman. Lightman must be playing the headline show. He's a wizard. Man, play them sick guitar licks. Yeah, apparently people don't hate me. Ooh, nice, Cran. Hopefully you got some tasty pizza. That was the best show I've the seen. Will echo in my soul for well, at least these guys like my my play. A oh, thank you, thank you. Cool. All right, what we got up here? Lightning up on the galaxy stage. Wait, I want to go to the elevator. Totally past it. Ah, here we go. Where to? That is the question, isn't it? So I'm going to the mezzanine. What even is a mezzanine, anyways? Anyone know? I sure as hell don't. Any longer to digest. I wouldn't say I'm impressed just yet. Well, jeez, I guess I'll try harder, man. Well, I'm glad we got a few more shows to go. I don't appreciate you guys. Look, all right. Nice show, kid. At least she liked it. Still not gonna serve you. Oh, come on. Rules of this bar clearly state no whinging. Be gone. <laughs> Won't serve to a minor. How dare she? I'm the opening act. I deserve some. Why wouldn't you do it? Why wouldn't I do what? Right. The whole project my image thing. 
Oh, yeah, he totally passed up an opportunity to have his image of him performing broadcast every screen, speaker, hologram in the galaxy. Yeah, no one really warned me about that. She was going to broadcast you across the universe. How you doing, Bob? Welcome back to the stream. Good to see you're still hanging around. She was going to broadcast my lasers across the universe. Yeah, I did kind of screw her over on that. She's a laser show artist and... Yeah. <laughs> Why the hell wouldn't you do it? Because I just know... He doesn't want the universe to know who he is. Especially if the people he lives with. dressed up playing nonsense... Everyone? You mean Calypso? That's everyone I know. <laughs> that is everyone he knows. <laughs> Why do you care? What could they possibly think of you? I mean, he's playing on the universe's biggest stage. What? I realize he's afraid of moving out from his uncle's shadow, but come oh, on, man. No, I'm ashamed that I'm not what I'm supposed to be. That when I said I was a folk musician, I was lying to them. Now, you're definitely not a folk musician, bud. You're not Johnson Vendetti. You're a kid. You're not meant to have it all figured out. <laughs> not that Calypso. But man, I haven't played Twisted Metal in forever. It was already figured PS1, out. PS1 Twisted Metal, that game was my jam. And I still couldn't make it stick. You see, even when the path is so clear, I am just continuing. So remember going to my buddy's house, because I never had those games. My buddy did. Go over to his house, hang out for hours. And we would just play that fucking game. Absolutely. You could have toured the galaxy. You would have never seen Calypso again. She's got Why a point. Wouldn't you do it? He's a teenager trying to discover who he is, and he has no idea what the fuck he wants to do. I mean, he does, but he's afraid to do it. He's afraid to take them steps. Closed. All right. Oh, there's this weird dude again. Lightning is returning to the travel gate. He'd like a word. I'm sure he would. Mr. Weird Floating Brainstem Fish Man. Where to? What crazy ass planets can you send me to next? Lounge music. A little bright for my taste, but it's a way to make an entrance, I suppose. You were late on the pyro in the third act. You were early. You know it. <laughs> Must have been a lag in the backing tracks. Who wants to blame? How'd the kid do? Trom's offered to project his image across the known universe. Aha! Incredible! What, really? Yep, he turned it down. Yep, like an idiot. Could have been super famous across the entire known galaxy. Granted, he's a kid from Earth who didn't even know there was a known galaxy until a couple of hours ago, but still. He didn't. Oh, well, of course he did. He's an artist, barely in his formative years. The prodigy, a master's apprentice. You know the chance that kid just blew? High on Life was a lot of fun. A lot of chaos in that Us? game. For me, Mark? But definitely some funny moments. My name is... Your name's gonna be nothing if you keep missing <laughs> your cues. I don't think I have it. The guns were definitely a fun thing to have there chatting with you. When you're ready for the next show, meet me at the travel gate. And all the weird little references and stuff. Youngblood, what are you doing? 
That's a good question. What am I doing? What do you mean? If you don't want any attention, why are you playing guitar? Why are you dancing around? And he's got why a point. Put on a show, huh? I can't not. I just gotta play, cause that's what everyone wants. Cause I got lightning in my hands. I mean, you could adjust how often they talk to you, too, so I don't know why they're annoyed by it. You can go in the settings and adjust how frequently they addressed you. Uh, I don't know. What do y'all think I, I should say? I can't not. I just gotta play. Yeah. Because that's what everyone wants. It's got lightning in my fingers. One in my hands, but yeah. Hmm. I guess I'll go with the lightning thing. Eh. I nah, can't about that one. Not. I just gotta play. Now that's the correct answer. Oh, really? I picked the right one. What are you afraid of? I gotta play. Can't help, man. I just gotta play. It's hard to explain. Afraid they'll laugh at you. No. Well, yes, but. That's not the biggest part of it. Back home, I mean something there. His home sees him as the... He's a dying town. The only thing they're known for is producing one of the world's greatest folk musicians who died. And he's that kid... He's that guy's nephew. They are put on a, a concert with him as the head, so hoping he would be the guy to bring everything back to town. That's a lot of pressure to put on a teenager. Like... I'm gonna bring back something that's lost. Well, baby, sounds like the world's on your shoulders. <laughs> I thought I'd grow into this folk mastermind. I'm starting to realize that might not be who I am. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You're out there playing funky 80s sci-fi riffs. That scares me. I'm glad you're never gonna give them what they want. You're probably right. Problem is, you think you've only got two options. Either giving everybody what they want, or failing. You haven't even considered there's a third option, have you? What's that? Are you an artist? Am I an artist? That's a deep question, man. I don't even know what to say to that. I think just a solid yes. Yes, I'm an artist. I am art. Yes. An artist's job is not to give people what they want, Francis. That's such it's a lame give name. People something they could never have imagined. It's an Can interesting take question? on things. Did you ask me to come out here because of my uncle? Your uncle? Who's your uncle? No one. No one at all. <laughs> huh? Off we go on to our next planetary planetary jam sesh, I guess. Best way to put it. What planet are we going to now? I'm tripping balls, man. I'm gonna lose my noodles. Where did I just go? Uh, maybe? I mean, I was thinking more 2001 A Space Odyssey, but... Uh, yeah, I see where you're coming from. <laughs> Whoa, am I where I'm supposed to be? That's the big question, man, ain't it? That's, that's like, whoa, deep. Am I where I'm supposed to be? Man. Hard to tell. 
What's your first impression? The smell of crystals, crystal prawn dumplings. Hmm, I do like dumplings. A violent glittering in the eyeballs. Painful. There's a voice on the wind. A tenor singing about something beautiful, but lost. I'm going to keep, keep up with the deep thoughts here, I think. That feels like the right way to go, you know? What do you mean, dumplings? Mmm, dumplings. I go great with noodles. Hmm. I don't know the voice on the wind. No, I do actually kind of hear it. There's a voice on the wind, uh, a tenor, singing about something beautiful but lost. That's the place. Like how that's the description she needed to be like, yep, you're in the right spot. The stage on this rock is the Lumiere Violante. Lumiere Violante. Jazz club, gaudy, ultra exclusive. Nice. You got a plan for that? Arrive late, leave early, steal glassware. I got riffs to raise jazz clubs. Perform like a sickly wig wear and virtuoso die on stage. That's life. That right there. Now, if you're going to a jazz, this is Arrive late, that's the one. Leave early, steal glassware. A lot jerk. <laughs> and good luck finding the place. What do you oh, mean? Wait. It's hidden? Not hidden, but I've never found it in the same place twice. You know, a little bit of direction for Play once would be very helpful. Straight back to the lawn. Wait, don't you flake out again. Uh, and she's gone. Just a little bit of direction is all I'm asking for here. Is that too much? Yep. Splish splash. Splish splash. Splishy splashy. Ooh, what? Uh... Where'd it go? I didn't realize my guitar playing was that bad and you had to run away. Things are weird me out, man. Ooh, bouncy. <laughs> bouncy bubbles. <laughs> Boing. These guys are just floating up on out here, ain't they? That was a very good bounce, I will say. It's a very exotic planet. I was at the Bellagio in Vegas. Oh. You're adding like a flutey sound. Flute fish. Ooh, a city. I assume that's where the jazz band, or the jazz club is. What 
the hell? You are now experiencing a fish is You got a growth that emits light like that, you should probably go see a doctor. The all powerful globoscopic wonder krill! Oh the wonder krill. Alright. Whoa. You're that's an experience, alright. Are you experiencing the wonder krill? I'm experiencing it alright. Totally experiencing, experiencing something. It. <laughs> I did say that this game might have something to do with a certain substances. It's like clinging to a re-entry ramjet. A record playing in a dream room. Tchaikovsky cannonade. Tchaikovsky, no! Tchaikovsky, yes! What a madman, putting cannons in his music. It's a Tchaikovsky cannonade. The appearance of a wonder grill is a complex affair. I'll agree with that. Where, with whom, what time, in what manner of lighting? Here, me, this time, and daylight. The wonder grill asks these for the answers can reveal truths about ourselves. What if I only want to reveal everything I'm not? Nothing's true about me. I'm a kaleidoscope, man. Why is the lighting important? What that one. What if I only want to reveal everything I'm not? Then search for your reflections in darker waters. What is your destination, little fish? I'm not a fish. At least I don't think I'm a fish. I'm usually a bowl of noodles. You heard of the Lumiere Volante? For a while, it was in the sewing drawer of a school canteen. Now, that's a weird place for a jazz club. Then the aviary of a king. Last a little better. I heard, it was near the city of Beige. Now, that's a boring city. The city of Beige. But nothing has drawn breath in veins for five hundred years. Mildly ominous. Place is tombed and cocooned. Only way in is beneath. Through the caves. Through caves. You have experienced the all-powerful Globoscopic <laughs> Wonder Grip. Well, I mean, you should be able to hear his voice, because he is speaking. But, uh... If you can't hear the game, let me know and I'll have to figure that out. I mean, he is also a, I think, 17-year-old musician, so... I wouldn't say you're too far off the point. Okay, cool. So from the beaches to the red sand deserts, leading to the city of beige. More strange critters. Look at these majestic lurching things. <laughs> they seem quite friendly. I have no way of knowing what they're called, but I would have named them pink spotted rock stompers. <laughs> really? That's the name you're gonna go with? Pink spotted rock stompers. Sure, why not? I'll leave the pink spotted rock stompers behind. Alright, hold on guys, I'll be right back. I need to grab a drink. Ugh.
All right. And just like that, I have returned with a beverage in hand. Let's get the music back, man. Can't stop the music. Boing. Comes my rocket stage. So we found the way into the caves, folks. Hey, bioluminescent caves. All about the light, man. Oh, so I found the place. The Lumiere Volante. The Wonder Krill was right. It was in the caves. Musique diabolique. Members Suleiman. I don't know what that means. I don't speak French. Musique diabolique. I can figure that one out. Cool. I can already hear the jazz. Yeah, man. Listen to that jazz. Oh. Well, I fucked that jump up. <laughs> There we go. Oh, hello. Floating rock. I feel like that's not the safest way to travel from point A to point B, but um, to each their own, I suppose. Through the Caves of Wonder. Turn on the stage. A fancy little laser light show going on. This is how you make an entrance right here. Wow. Yeah. Well, it's like I found the place. Uh, pretty empty for a jazz club, yeah? The hell is that? Oh. Sounds like it speaks in smooth jazz. Welcome to Lumia Violante. Are you a member? Full up tonight. No, I'm... Oh. That's a strong Manhattan. Whew. The talent? I am the talent. I know it. Magnifique, no time to waste. The audience is restless. There's no one here. Well, we are very exclusive. So exclusive, there is no audience. He is the only member. Mr. Speaks and Smooth Jazz. Oh, fuck that up. All right. Oh, 
I will say that pretty much this game boils down to just being decent as Simon says, but uh, I'm okay with it. These visuals. So now I fucked that up too, apparently. Down the house. Ah, you got the strange sound to you, my friend. Can't unleash that trust anywhere. Really? I feel like I want to play every stage in the universe. Almost every stage. <laughs> Except for the one he's supposed to be playing tonight. Back home. No, it's too precious a thing. The flowers are not stuck in the vase. They are dancing with it, you feel me? Right, like the setting informs the content. Sure. Her song is rich, profound even. But placed in the wrong vessel, his meaning could be skewed out of shape. I understand. So, that's it? That's the whole show? It'd be great to have you back any time. Best of luck on your travels. Best of luck? Violetta said you'd give me a ride back to the Cosmic Lung. Afraid not? <laughs> Excuse me? We used to have an arrangement with Beige. They ferried people back to the loan, no questions. Did it on a giant turtle. But they've stopped picking up the phone. A giant turtle? Oh, joy. Giant space turtles. Well, what am I supposed to do? Everyone loves a good giant space turtle, I must say. Best I can offer you is this. <laughs> Dress code strictly applied. No What's plus this? Is all that was left in beige. You want to book a follow-up show? I'll call you. <laughs> and off we go. Into the great beyond. Here. Green, power, repression, rebellion. Hmm. Usual stuff. A little close to real life, if you ask me. So, what do I do now? Honestly, no idea. Yeah, that's fair. Keep broadcasting, I guess. <laughs> Just let the lung keep watching. Before. You're kidding me. This place used to have a warp turtle. <laughs> Hopefully, so I can now? still find one. I guess I left with everyone else. <laughs> fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Totally and utterly fantastic. I love the wide range of choices here. Yeah. Uh, yeah, totally why not? and utterly fantastic. Sarcasm levels max. You got a lot of people tuning in. Your broadcast has been syndicated across the galaxy. Nice. What? When? Why? All good questions. <laughs> it's a morbid answer. Ratings go up when someone gets stranded. Because, you know. It could all go wrong. Yeah. People like to watch train wrecks. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, weird little grass critters. Play music through the dead halls of a non existent city.
Rows and rows of people. All the same. Lame. What happened in this place? All beige. Gives me some kind of uh, journey-esque vibes for you who've played that game. Fantastic game, by the way. PS3 era. A city without color. Hence the name beige. Without a singular flourish. That's a pretty lame city to live in. You got a problem with me taking this? <laughs> Depends. What's in it for me? Uh, I think you should put it back. Nope. It's always about what's in it for me, right? That's how things go around here. Uh, yeah, let's go with that one. For me. You're not well, that's quite the uh, crazy outfit she's got there. Your suit's custom. No labels, no trademark, no specific signature. It's the yeah. first time you've worn that suit. You're not wrong. You got some talent, there, lady. That's right. Your glasses. Herman and Funklum, distributed in the central and eastern USA. So you're <laughs> some hotshot fresh out of Earth, huh? Pretty impressive that she knows that, and the people out here knew of Earth. First tour. First tour. How oh, fun. What's your destination? Welcome to the stream, everybody. If you're having a good time watching this uh, trip of a video game, and you haven't already, go ahead and hit that follow button. Really help me out. See more crazy stuff in the future. Definitely including more of this. Well, I'm trying to get back to the cosmic lung. <laughs> I've got to find a warp turtle. Yep, good old warp turtle. Can't go nowhere without one of those. Not really sure where to begin. A warp turtle. The only warp turtle in these parts resides in the walled city of Glimmer. Glimmer. Sounds like the opposite of beige. And where is that exactly? You want a lift? I would love a lift. You got a ride? Darling, I've got the ride. I like this lady. She kind of gives me, um... Edna Mode vibes. And again, who doesn't love Edna Mode, right? <laughs> Alright, very Howl's Moving Castle. I'm here for it. Yeah, very, very Howl's Moving Castle. I'm down for it. Music in this right now is giving me strong um, old school Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy vibes. I even watched the old uh, 80s British TV series. Uh, it's a, a real reach, very specific niche content there. But if you haven't, you should definitely go watch that series. It is fantastic. Place to stand out. <laughs> they call me Frida. Hello, Frida. That's an appropriate My name. My ship is the Rubicola. I am the unusual. I forgot to date myself that. <laughs> Get yourself acquainted with the ship. I'll be in the lounge. That's an appropriate name for me still.
enjoying your pizza crayon? Oh my. It's a strangely haired or headed fellow. This is the view from the portal. <laughs> Glad to hear it, man. That is the view from the rear of the ship. The poop deck, if you will. Eh, poop. Some epic scenery, though. I must say. Definitely some epic scenery. Oh, okay. All right, Frida Carlo, what do you have to say? Carvaggio, this is uh, unusual. Carvaggio. Nice Don't to speak to it. <laughs> oh, sorry. It is an ordeal. To speak to the creature is an ordeal. Not eh? for the unprepared. I am prepared. I'm prepared. Now, glimmerdim. 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 You what about Glimmer Dim? Dress like that, darling. Hey, what's wrong with my threads? What's wrong with this? They are devotees of style, fashion, form. At least they think they are. <laughs> the guitar I heard in beige. That was you, wasn't it? Yeah, that was me. Yeah, I can wail. Yeah, I was jamming with a neon shrimp. You ain't heard nothing yet. Yeah, I was jamming with the neon shrimp. You're a musician, and musicians see themselves as ocean terrors. Do they, though? A life of Can musicians out there solitude. testify that is how you see yourself as an ocean terror? Defined only by the brilliance of their things. Is this true or is this false? Only musicians shall know. The opposite is true. Great artists surround themselves in a menagerie of wildlife. I think I understand. Really? Because I got nothing of that. Take great care in your creative entourage. Rumors, images, fashion, lighting. Take care as if setting a precious stone in platinum. I've got a closet in my quarters near the front of the ship. Go see what you can find. All right. Why not? Let's go change up the outfit here. Going into the closet. Wait. She's... This is her... It's a straight up mall. Whoa. Wait, what? And what for some reason, suit? I'm in my skivvies. Unmentionables. Socks. Oh, I'm gonna actually get to customize my outfit. Nice. I don't even get to customize my guitar. Dragon tails. Dragon tails, dragon tails. Oh man, I just got hit with a wave of nostalgia there. Ouch. Stratocannon. 15th century mace. Warp sky hammer. Actually, I really like the warp rider. I'm going to choose the colors too. Ooh, kind of like that one. Yeah. Tertiary. No, no. Maybe a little that now. Hmm. Yeah. Oh wait, I was gonna. Socks, ankle socks, long socks. Nice. It's a lot of cheese. 
Yeah, I'm down for some dominoes, man. Look. That's a lot of cheese. Leggings. Pattern leggings. Garters. Fishnets. I don't even know what I'm going for here. Sure, why not? I'm down for it. Turtle and the hare. Bull cut. <laughs> Very 80s. Swish. Francis. Violetta. All right. Dragon. Pancakes. It's very updo right there. Jeez. I think I'm going to go with something. Yeah. Business in the front, party in the back. Heck yeah. Let's do it. Let's make it match the guitar, why not? Really hope this music playing in the background isn't going to get me uh, demonetized or anything crazy. Alright, Cran, I appreciate you hanging out, man. Have a good one. Probably going to play this game again in the future. Hope you can come and uh, enjoy the trip. I right, got the hair, got the tights. Nice. Ooh, shades. Vaza. I can go for some hardcore 80s here. B and D's that. Okay. Talk about wingtips. I'm having a conversation with uh, the missus earlier about some wingtips. Light visor. Yeah. Be the baddest mother around. Look at that. Look at that style. Got my drip. Heist movie, the movie. DeWine Intervention. Tandemonium, Titanosaurus, Scarelift, and Pyramid Scheme. Some nice ripped jeans. Cuffed pants. What screams the most 80s? That's what I'm wondering. What do y'all think? What screams 80s? Or 70s? No, let's go 70s. What screams like 70s hairband? Think of them. And printed pants. I think in the shiny pants, maybe. Now we'll go with the printed pants, why not? Change it up to match the theming. Oh, that one kind of hurts my eyeballs. <laughs> there we go. Be the ugliest mother you've ever seen. The most clashingest outfit of all time. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Turtleneck, Steve Jobs. Mesh top, yes. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that one. I think I'm a little darker up here, yeah. There's some, uh, yeah, some of that. And uh, a little bit of that. Oh, yeah. I 
Yeah. That's be Face facets. No, face paint. Very kiss. I like it. Let's see. What am I looking at here? About, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm here for it. What all's left? Oh, sneakers. Yeah, can't go run around in my socks. Cowboys. Space boots. Strappy sandals. Feel like, uh, yeah, let's go with some. I should just leave them black. Fully metal jacket. <laughs> Is that a full metal jacket? Y'all get the reference there? Yeah? You getting it? <sighs> Feather shoulders. Man, the power shoulders. All right. Fringed vest. Heck yeah, man. You know, I'm feeling the. I just got the cowboy jacket. You know what? I'm actually gonna change up the colors a little bit. A little more contrast is what we need. A little more in your face. A little more, ouch, my eyeballs hurt, actually. You know what? Never mind. Change my mind. I already picked my. <clears throat> How do I look? Here we go. Yeah. Nailed it. Jumpsuit. Ugh. Ugh. Actually, I do kind of like that. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I do. Uh... All right, yeah, that's happening. Gloves. Mystic. Ooh. Spike gloves. Well, if I'm gonna start with it. I guess I'll go full Brook Bones, or Brook, uh, full on Brook from One Piece. Yeah, I look dope. Totally look dope, guys. Ain't nothing gonna stop me now. Striking. A statement. What do you think, Calvaggio? A triumph of the human spirit! Calm down, Carvaggio. Sorry about that. Now, where did you get this outfit? From the mall in your wardrobe. Incorrect. Where in all the wondrous cities and canals and black holes of the universe did you get this? So where's this? What's the story of my oh. outfit? Stole it. I won it. It was gifted to me. I think I won it. If you think that's uh, I the story. Want it. In a dice game on a white collar prison cruise. In a light year death race around the Horsehead Nebula. With a 10 for 0 rampage 
in the Vidodrome worlds. Sounds like a good time. With a 10 for 0 rampage in the Vidodrome worlds. Wonderful, courageous Calvajo. All right, ready for more screaming in red. All right. Now, I don't mean to alarm you, but there's a hologram hovering about the ship. Says he's a friend of yours. And I don't mean to be rude, but he's attracting chromosquitos. Not chromosquitos. Oh, it's Lightman. Of course it's Lightman. These crow mosquitoes are making me nervous. That you, Francis? My name is... I get fully into character. Aren't you about to go on? Yeah. Lost his stuff. Can't. What? What? What happened? Came out here to be the opening act for his show, and now he's been canned. Oh, a lot of things happened. This is the latest and long sequence of happened things. I'm so sorry. It's not your fault, son. Oh, yeah. Well, it is actually. Uh. I've been promoted to the captain of the cosmic lung. What? I've been what? No, no, that's insane. It is. The red right hand in charge of broadcast has sent word. Red right hand. There's more people watching your show than mine. Therefore, you're the captain. Well, you player promotion is in my future. No. You have to tell them I'm. No, 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 no arguing with the ratings, kid. Yeah, he's got a point the there. Galaxy's got their eyeballs on you. The galaxy's righteous, man. Half the galaxy. Half the galaxy? I never made it this far into Glamourdon. It's rather wonderful, isn't it? I mean, you still have it. I guess things seem more wonderful when they're ending. It was his farewell tour, so... Uh, that's a bit of understatement there, Are I must say. Got everything you need from the closet? As I'll ever be. Yeah, I'm a sensation. Yeah, I'm a sensation. Damn Skippy. What's your plan to get in, love? I've got a ticket. Really? Oh, I see. That's yeah, kind of the boring way in, so but... There's no need for it. Daring guns blazing infiltration? <laughs> I don't think so. Jesus. Listen. They're gonna resist you at first. Mock you. Because they've never seen anything like you. Yeah. The Glimmer Dimmerinians think they've reached Glimmer Dimmerinians. They're wrong. It's quite the name. Their attention. Make yourself seen. I can do that. Well, they're unusual. It was an affair. Yes, it was. I'll miss you too, big guy. Goodbye, friends. Thanks for everything, and good luck. He is sure as hell going to have one interesting story to tell the folks back home about why he's not uh, a folk musician anymore. He's moved on to bigger, better things. It's quite the bulbous city. Our name for ourselves in the big city. Aye, not a 
step closer. What are you? What am I? Leader of the infinity loud, infinitely loud galactic symphony. Most famous child of Garmouth. Leader of the infinitely loud galactic symphony. And this is my ticket. A new city of glimmer. Oh, it's lovely. To Can't argue with that. Gorgeous ticket. Look at <laughs> that gold. I am looking at it. It's the gold specifically that has caught the attention of my artisan's eye. So a town where everyone's supposed to like the same what things. What value would you say that was? Well, I would guess it's golden toothpaste 22. That was my evaluation too, sister. Golden toothpaste 22. <sighs> okay, sister. Calm down. Oh, dear. Oh, you read about it. Never think you'll see it. Official color guidelines state all official documents use golden toothpaste 23C. Terribly sorry. Please leave immediately. Uh, how do you know it's not 23C? It's totally 23C. Is comical. Hey. Comic. Have it your way. I'm off to unleash an unholy racket. I'm off to supply a riot. I'm off to burn the whole goddamn system down. Jesus, guy. Sit down a minute, man. I'm off to burn the whole goddamn system down. Hey, this kid really wants to get at it, doesn't he? Stop that thing! It's called a pilot clash. Stop that creature! You'll learn to love it. Slide on down. Woo! This is a fashionista. Sing fashionista. Man, look at that hat. Stop. Stop in the name of good taste. Absolutely not. I cannot allow such rebellion. Such them. Such rebellion. I am here for the rebellion. Such great different cut for the rules. Yep. Screw your rules, man. Down with the status quo. You ain't squishing me there, bud. Ah, ah, no, no. <laughs> Apparently, I didn't make that jump. There we go. It's one way to make yourself known. He's a maverick. Just charge through a city in your radical new outfit. Playing some sick ass riffs on your guitar. They gotta know who you are. One way or another, they will know. I am the unusual Soba. That's not nice. Awesome. The heck are those? Cameras, maybe? Over the highway. Oh, crap. That was close. Low bringing down the house. On our chaotic run through the city. Yeah! Alright. Oh. Kinda wanted to go see what was over there, but alright.
Got the entire city's attention now, I bet. That is an ugly aircraft. Stop! Stop! Psychopaths! I can do that. What ha? Huh? Two hundred and forty seven errors, violations That's of it. the How do you please? I can disappear, Will. He'll never catch me. Guilty is all sin. Deportation slash execution squad inbound. Wait, hold up. Uh, let's talk about this. Warning! 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 Enemy ship detected. Enemy ship. It's Frida. You to bomb, Frida. Your ship's much better than that one anyway. Get up, Venus, out of here. Don't let them assimilate you. You're a desert flower. I am a desert flower. Thank you, Frida. Just gotta make it to the to the turtle, guys. Must make it to the turtle. Or a sick ride. I don't know what I'm flying in, but it's pretty sick. I'm loving it. I want one for my own personal use. I made of the docks, wherever that is. Hey, they love me now. Look at that. Perhaps it's a maverick? Yes, yes I am. Starting a revolution, darlings. A revolution. Thank you, thank you. I'll be here all night. That's a lie. I'll be here till I found the warp turtle. I'm all about getting me a warp turtle. This must be very exciting for you. <laughs> Just busted through somebody's house. <laughs> Shredding through the light beam, look at that. That is sick. Shredding in a light beam, the only way to travel. Absolute light beam shreddage. I know you got me on the the cuboid monitors. The city's in chaos. Man, who did that? It sure as hell wasn't me. I do have golden toothpaste twenty-two. Travel by spotlight. Man, 
entire city's got its eyes on me. The giant mechanical eyes. Oh, there he is again. Enough! Damn! Seriously, enough! What is wrong with you? I've got kids running all over the city, wearing endless non-regulation regalia! Good. So take weeks to clean up. I am the unusual! I am the fashionista, chef editor of Glimmer. What do you want? The fashionista. Well, if it's got no style. Tim, you're trying to get to the cosmic extraordinary. Affirmatron. No? Affirmatron. No. Impossible. Well, if you'll excuse me, I hear the pitter patter of revolution a few rooftops over. <laughs> no. No. Wait. Wait. This is my one final and singular. Offer. All right, what you got, bud? You may take the turtle dim. Good. But once clear of my city limits, I will pursue you. I will destroy you on a mount of my choosing. Bring it on. Do you accept? I will take you out. Cue the chase music. Cue the chase music. Wake the warp turtle! <laughs> Wake the warp turtle! We're almost a dim, guys. We're almost to the warp turtle. I don't like that. Hey, look, guys. We found dim, the warp turtle. Hello, Mr. Turtle. The warp turtle. You've been hard to find, my friend. I've been waiting for you, Francis. Uh, that's what did you a little say? disconcerting. <sighs> Works for me? Let's hit it. How did he know my name? That's what I want to know. I think once we get back to the Cosmic Lung again, we'll call it a night. Sounds like we have a chase scene to play. I want a flying cosmic warp turtle. Sounds like the best way to travel. With a built-in sound stage and everything. That's the mount. It seems a little unfair to me. That's the mount he chose. Never. It would be the stylish thing to do. Nope. Take the fight to you, bud. You can outplay me and your weird whatever the hell that thing is. I think not. I'll take you down with the power of rock, man. That's what I thought.
final fight, I think. Pick up the pace, Warp Turtle. Kick it into Warp Drive. Get that little tail wagon. Don't let him get away! Go where I want. You can't catch me? Good. Hope your town falls to chaos and ruin. The Glimmer Dimmerinians are free of your tyranny, Mr. Fashionista. Yeah. Ooh, I think we did it, folks. Whoa. Back to the trippy, I see. Thanks for the lift, Tim. I appreciate it. You're the best warp turtle I've ever met. Oh, here we go again. And we're back. Aboard the Cosmic Lung, folks. That particular trip has been completed. I made it. Yeah. I made it. Oh, we definitely made it, folks. Yeah. That was weird. Controls got stuck. Alright guys, this feels like a good spot to call it for the night. Oh, it's been a, it's been a hell of an adventure this day. Oh, I can't wait to see what's going to happen next and where we go next and what crazy hijinks the unusual Soba will get into. For now, this is me thanking you for watching. If you haven't already, I would appreciate it if you go ahead and hit that follow button. It help me out immensely. I hope you all have a wonderful night. I'll see you again soon. So bad.